Baz just does the most incredible mandala work. I'd never seen this 3D mandala work before. Uh, I'd seen regular mandalas, I'd coloured loads of them. But have a look at this. This is what a 3D mandala is all about. So can you see, it looks like the light's coming from here and you've got darkness all around here. That's because of the way you do the shading. So for this, you need a light, a medium and a dark pen in every coloration. Plus, you need to learn how to 3D up your mandala. So let me just show you another one. Same idea again, light source coming from this direction again. Lighter here, darker over here. Looks all very, very 3D. Now, let me show you how Baz is going to teach you exactly how to do that. Again, you get full instructions in the kit. Now, you can see there how Baz's mandalas look so dimensional. This is what he's going to teach you how to do, okay? As we open this up, you're going to learn a little bit more about Baz. Go and follow him on Instagram and you can learn all about how he does his techniques, see more of his mandalas, get more to colour in. Then he's going to start talking about the tools. Now, in this collection, this was just crying out to work without tri-blends. So each one of these pens is three pens in one, where you have a light, a medium and a dark colour. And that is what's going to allow you to do three-dimensional colouring, right? So if I just put all this together, because I am going to show you that in just a second, you get the blue, the green and the uh, coral in here. To put you into perspective, you couldn't buy three of these pens for the price of this whole kit okay so he's going to teach you all about the pens then he's going to teach you how to do it step by step so this is how you do your blending and he's going to teach you how to do this three-dimensional effect using the two brush uh, the two fine liner pens from the art liner collection so in here you've got a 0 0.1 mil and a 0 0.3 mil and he talks about selecting your uh, your light source and then according to that can you see in this set here you're going to emphasize some of your lines now let me just show you exactly what that means you do get a, a, a load of his designs to color and copy off on here so for example here is that beautiful one that's been done up here in the blues i love this right so what he talks about i'm going to follow his step-by-step -step guide imagine where the light's coming from so let us imagine that the light is coming down from the top here what you're going to do, I'm going to see if you can get a little bit closer for you to be able to see this. Everything that touches the top of the light, you're going to emphasise with your, with your number one tip point, right? So this is the number one. Everything underneath the light point, right? So as you come further down, you're going to emphasise with the number three brush point, which is much thicker which is how you're going to get that three-dimensional look, right? So we're going to emphasise the number three. You can see that's thicker up here. So again, you're going to follow all the way around the top one and you're going to follow that. So if, if I want the light to come from this direction, for example, I would follow this all the way around with this collection, right? With this side, with this pen. And then I'd come around with the other side with the number three, which you can see is much thicker and it's just how you get all of that three-dimensionalness into the drawing of the mandala. So you've got to emphasise the mandala and that's exactly what he's showing you on this drawing here and how to do that. That's the first stage. Then you're going to come in, let me just show you the one that I've been starting to colour here, right? So if I'm colouring, I've imagined the light source is coming from here. So you want your light, your medium and your dark. So if we just colour over, say we're going to colour uh, this section in here, right? What you're going to do is you're going to start, we're going to colour everything with our light one, right? So we're light there. In fact, let's just colour over all of this section with our light. Now you're imagining that your light source is coming from here. So everything underneath that line would have a little bit of dark. So I'm coming in now with the darkest shade and putting in a little bit of that shading along there. So everything around this area is going to have the darker shade one coming in, right? And then you come in with the medium pen, which is your colour in the middle, and just colour over where the dark one gets to the light one. And what it does is the medium pen bleaches out some of the colour in the darker pen, so it starts to give it a, a brushed out 3D look. We do the same, we come in with the lightest one and you can see there now with that lightest pen, we're going back over again and we're making the whole element 
look truly three dimensional you see how it looks like the lights coming from one side this is what i've done here so if we take this section here you can see we put the dark pen in here then the medium then the light right at the edge and that's how you get that truly three-dimensional look and you're going to have that with the greens you're also going to have it with the corals which is where if you want to do beautiful coloring like this one here this is predominantly coral you can see we've got the lighter shades here moving to the dark ones here imagining the light sources coming from here and you're also going to get the same with the blue so whether you want to do blue and green shades like this it's all about getting that 3d mandala coloring now what i would say is any of you out there watching who have friends who have been getting into coloring and they want to just take their coloring up another level and want to try something different what a brilliant kit to get them started because you've got a few of the mandalas to get started with the colouring. You've got three of the colour plans for you to be able to work with. You've got all of the instructions for how to be able to take regular mandala colouring right up to 3D mandala colouring. And then you can go on Baz's Instagram page, learn a load more and have all the tools you need to get you started. That's why this is a fantastic kit for all levels of colourist. Mm -hmm.